time right now. 1.41 a.m. You know. It's fucking late. So I was in the washroom just fucking rapping Juice World Bandit. I'm like recreating TikTok. Like there's that one where, you know, Juice World's like, you know how he's like mumbling like blah, 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 blah. and then I don't know if you've seen the fucking TikTok. He can't talk because he has food in his mouth or some shit. And then, like, the producer walks away, and then the producer, like, and then he spits fine, and the producer's like, what? I'm like, oh, goddamn, right? He comes back. <clears throat> I was, like, fucking hyping out to that shit. I was, like, pretending to be the fucking producer. Like, oh, shit, bro. Oh, goddamn. <laughs> fucking dancing. And uh, I was going to make a TikTok, but I couldn't find Juice World, the song, because so I was thinking of, like, <clears throat> I was talking to this old friend. I was like, you know, man, I wasn't saying this, man, but we were just talking about life and what they're going to do. And then it hit me. I was like, what the fuck happened? How the fuck did I go from being able to talk to who the fuck ever? Like, whoever. And they just instantly want, I'm not trying to come off as cocky, but I'm just being, like, honest. And they instantly, instantly just want to talk to me. Like, they were just nice. They just actually genuinely meant what they said. You know what I mean? And then it, it just fucking, it freaking, it just freaking dawned on me like a big ass fucking, it was like right there. I was like, oh my God, I was myself. And like, I know how stupid that might sound. Okay, hold on, slow down, but it's true. I was myself. I was more myself back then than I've ever been now. And like, I was, I was really trying to think about why, why that is. And, uh, and like, <clears throat> The only conclusion I could come to was that I wasn't afraid. <laughs> like, I was not afraid of fucking stepping out of my comfort zone. And as stupid as it is to talk to girls, I'm not afraid to talk to girls, but like, I just hate saying the wrong thing, you know what I mean? But back then, I didn't give a shit. If I fucked up, I fucked up. If I said something that was amazing, I said something that was amazing. I didn't care, right? Now I'm like, hey, uh, how was your day? You know, be nice. And then it's only nice. Like, not nice. It's only, like, super cliche. Super, super, super cliche. And it's just, like, boring. You know what I mean? It's not fun. It's not. Now, I just had that combo. I, I get it. I fucking get it. All of it. But I was myself back then. And shit is weird. So, <clears throat> you know, as a little rowdy kid, I was also a bit of a, uh, a fuck boy. I, I, pfft, slow down, okay? Slow down, I know. Back then, I don't know what was going on with me. I think I just really craved the attention. Now, not so much attention, like, from, like, oh, my God, Denzel, like, uh, fucking, like, I love you. So, like, just, like, just that nurturing attention. But, like, thinking back on it now, man, <clears throat> Even, like, when I was fucking around with girls. That, like, a connection. That connection was there. You know what I mean? That connection, it just felt good. Like, it felt... Mm, like, I feel like an asshole. Like, I can't even... I don't like talking about it. Because it makes me feel bad. But, uh... I felt just good. Like, I was like, this girl is going to be around. I wasn't thinking, oh, I'm going to stop talking to her in a few weeks. I just felt comfortable with her, and it was never, like, I, I never really went out with the mindset of, hey, I'm going to start talking to you, and a week later, we're not going to talk again. But, uh, yeah, I mean, there's there's a few girls out there that I wish uh, I hadn't done a shit with. I mean, some of it's, like, whatever, you know what I mean? You know how it goes, and then some of it's, like, I wish I wouldn't have done any of that shit, is what I'm trying to say, but at the same time, I wish I wouldn't, uh, there's a few girls out there who I would, like, kill to talk to. It's kind of one in particular, but, uh, you know, she didn't want to talk to me, and that's fine. But, um, yeah, it just really got me thinking, like, how far I've come, how far away I've drifted, but, uh, and that, that, that was all because of how I was. It just dawned on me. I was just myself back then. Like, I'm not saying, you know, if I'm myself now, I'll pick up a bunch of girls. That's not what I'm trying to say. 
I'm just trying to say from my comfort zone. Everyone thinks that I'm so confident. I'm so this. So fucking amazing. So hyper. I'm so nice. I'm so uh, this. I'm so, like, you know what I mean? I'm not. I'm not. I'm, am I nice all the time? No. <laughs> am I hyper all the time? Yeah. But, like, kind of in here. My head's always fucking, like, ex ready to shoot up. Even when I'm fucking grumpy. <laughs> Yeah, unless, like, you catch me on a really bad time, but then I'm not. But, like, yeah, I was just really myself, and, uh, like, I, I say that fuckboy shit because <clears throat> I really cared for those people that I fucked over. Like, I wouldn't even say I fucked over them. I just, basically, I would talk to them for a little bit, and I would just slowly disappear. You know what I mean? Wouldn't send them, you know, raunchy stuff like that, but, uh. To the few out there that I did, um, I I was just so scared of that commitment. You know what I mean? I just didn't want that. Like I did so badly, but I didn't know how they were gonna react. And I was like, you know what? And if they're uh, if they're, I just didn't want to get. I, I don't know. I don't know, man. <sighs> There's just one girl though, and she still has me blocked to this day. And. Uh, uh, it's kind of a habit of mine to like talk to people that I haven't talked to in a long time. <laughs> but that girl, I, I, like, I feel so bad still. Um, but this is not a place to vent my fucking sad feelings. This is not. Because when I was thinking about all that sad shit, all that hype shit, everything just combined into one. I was thinking about everything. Like I said, I, I was just realizing how I was myself back then. And it all just connected. My, it just, ba -ding, the light bulb came up and I was just like, this is it. This is, this is how I get that feeling again. Feeling of being fucking confident. Feeling of being this, feeling of that. And I was like, you know what? I'm like, yeah, that's how I do it. Now, what the fuck am I talking about? Well, let me, let me, let me, let me tell you. So, um. Let me just take a minute, man. I, I really don't like talking about that shit. It makes me fucking sad. <laughs> like, it makes me upset. That's how it's such a douchebag. Fuck. I don't know why I was so confident. I really, I don't know. I was just myself. And how I, I was myself, I don't know. <laughs> I don't, I don't know. And like, what I mean by that is like, like, kind of like I said, like I said, like thinking before I speak, which is a good thing, don't get me wrong, but just being funny. Like, I feel fucking boring, man. I don't know why that is. But like, I plan to go to school in September, and September, January, I, my mom says September, I said January, but I'm just going to go with September anyway, because, yeah. Um, and I feel like, I know for a fact that that'll kind of give me all my energy back. Um, you know, one, I need some more friends, and two, uh, I just, it'll, it'll give me something to do, something fun. Which is fucking playing sports and maybe going to some parties. I've never ever been to a party in my life, you know that? Not because like I don't get invited, because I don't want to go. I, I'm fucking like, I don't know. Anyway. But yeah, um, <clears throat> but as for like getting girls, I don't really care to get girls. Like I don't, I don't know. As for like the confidence and all that, I don't care to get the girls. Like I'm past that, bit way past that. Like. Yeah, it's not that I can't get girls, like, I, I'm not saying I'm fucking perfect, like, I got fucking pimples and, like, my, like, I'm not perfect at all, like, a lot of girls don't even like fucking black guys, <laughs> but, like, I'm not perfect at all, but it's just, it's just, it's just for me, it's just that comfort, you know, like, I just, I, I don't know, I've always preferred having girlfriends over guy friends, just because they're so easy to talk to, like, 
I still got my homies like all the time. But I, it's like you know, like uh, you know what I'm talking about. Yeah, this is very comfort. <clears throat> And they give you that like sense of relief that you just don't get from fucking <laughs> guys. I mean, you know what I'm trying to say. But uh, yeah, they give you that like a sign of relief and just just happiness, just joy. Like I'm not trying to get all cringy on you, but like, you know what I mean? Just like it just feels good. Yeah, like, fucking every guy knows what I'm talking about. Like, it just, just feels good. But, uh, yeah. And, like, I talked about last time, like, what I want to do in life and all that. And, uh, it's still the same. I want to go and act. I want to do this. I want to do that. I just really want to fucking make this video. It's 2 in the morning. I just really want to fucking vent. Not vent. I just want to fucking talk. To be honest with myself. Because like, you know, yeah. As for like fucking being realistic and shit, man, fuck that shit, okay? Please tell me why in the fucking world I can't go and be a fucking neuroscientist or a fucking, I'm waiting. I fucking hate People say they can't do shit because they don't think they're good enough. Or they don't. They don't think their grades are good enough. Like, dude, if your grades are shit, that's fine. My grades are shit. Go to go take a fucking year two program at some area, like a community. I don't know, not community college per se, but community, uh, like community classes. But yeah, I, I, that's kind of it. I kind of want to fucking talk about this shit. Um, my next video will be fucking dope. Just wait. It's not gonna be this shit. It's gonna be good. It's gonna be this. It's gonna be that. I just really want to vent and talk at 2 in the morning. Because, uh, but yo, if you like the video, hit a like. If you didn't like it, you don't like it, or just like it. Um, if you want to follow me, like, through my journey, <laughs> and, uh, hopefully regain our sub count, um, my viewership back, and, uh, hit that sub box, and you can watch my videos all the time. Hit the bell notification, you know, you know how it goes. Anyway, my name is Dizel. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Um,